Hello and welcome back to more Mass Effect 3 Adept Insanity. In the last part we went over to Sirkesh, I believe, to check out the Krogan situation over there, how they're holding their females, and kind of solve the uh, whole genophage problem that they're encountering in order for them to actually help us fight against the Reapers. And in this episode, we have a multitude of things that we could do, such as go to Chichanka and continue along with helping out the Krogans, but I think that will be left for another day. I'm going to go over here to the Petra Nebula, Petra, Petra, I don't know how it's actually pronounced, but there is a little mission over here that I can get out of the way right about now. And that, uh, mass relay jump's always rather loud. <laughs> And let's head over here to the Grissom Academy. Yes. And we're supposed to be rescuing some biotic students or something of that nature from Cerberus captivity. Something like that. But nonetheless, uh, let's see, who do I want to take? Probably the good old Liara Garrus. Can't go wrong with it. Got overload, you have biotic powers, whole nine yards. It's fantastic. And let's see what I have. Um, I think this is all good. I don't think I actually unlocked any more weapon mods. I sure didn't. So, we appear to be good. Or, ah. Let's see, I don't think rounds for magazine. Eh. I don't know if they even actually if the AI actually even reloads or not, but I'll go ahead and slap that on there. Just because. And four points. I'm probably gonna end up removing energy drain. Doesn't seem as though I actually need it like I thought I would. And I did max out my warp and my biotic mastery and everything like that, so I think it's about time to start putting stuff into throw. So once you get up there, you have like double throw, that'd be nice, and detonate, which as you know, I just do nothing but detonations. So that detonate, increased force and damage by 50% will be very helpful. So I'm going to start working towards that, even though I don't necessarily need the force and whatnot, but oh well. Got to upgrade that as to get to it, and for you, what do I want to do with you? Probably... Just more into this. Assault rifle damage, sure. And what about you? Probably pure biotic. I don't think I actually need anything else for Liara here for the time being. Actually, I think I'm going to go warp ammo. I think she has enough uh, into pure biotic for now. That will be nice with the squad bonus, but eh. Oh well. That'll be for later. And wham wham. <laughs> the uh, joys of playing on Xbox one sec. Okay, we are back. <laughs> so yeah. Just like Mass Effect 2, Mass Effect 3 comes with two discs and you get to interchange them. Usually several times, depending on the order of the missions that you actually... The, the order of the missions that you take. Because some missions are saved onto one disc and some some of the data is on another, but yeah. There's the folks who answered the distress call. Cerberus Cruiser. At least a dozen fighters on blockade duty. Not too many for us in a straight up fight. They must want this place bad. Receiving incoming transmission. Let's hear it. SSV Normandy. This is Kaylee Sanders, director of Grissom Academy. We need immediate assistance. Cerberus is attacking the facility. They're after my students. This is Commander Shepard. We're blocked on a direct approach. I know. They've taken control of our docking bays. Any alternatives? There's an auxiliary cargo port I could probably open. All right. We'll come in by shuttle and get your students out of there. Joker, can you give me a diversion? Oh, boy, can I?
Come and get me. That seemed a little bit too obvious of a bait. Keep the shuttle in position. We'll be back. And away we go. Or, I guess not. I'm just going to uh, casually stroll on in there. Here we go. I have control of my character. Yay! Oh, hello. That didn't take very long. Uh, <laughs> Garrus is, like, trying to kill himself. That is a grenade. I'm going to try to get away from that. That would have been bad. And what do we got? I don't know if I can actually shoot that guy. Oh, well. That's that. Is that all of them? Seems a bit, uh... Sanders, we're clear. It's me. Seemed a bit too easy. Commander, thank you. Admiral Anderson always said you were the best. And with Cerberus coming for my students, I need the best. How many of you are there? Fewer than 20. Most were sent home when word of the Reaper invasion spread. But a few volunteered to stay. Some are prototyping tech for the Alliance. Others are biotics. They've been training for military operations, working together as biotic artillery. A few months knocking over practice dummies can't prepare your students for war. Agreed, but the Alliance needs every resource it can get. And our students are unique resources. They wanted to help. How could we say no with the entire galaxy falling apart? Hang on. I've been trying to get communications working. This is Frovark. There are students trapped in Orion Hall. Cerberus has us boxed in. They're closing fast. Damn it. Orion Hall? Back out the door and down the hallway. I can get the door open. I'll bring them back here and we'll make a run for the shuttle. Thank you, Commander. I'll stay put. With luck, I can regain control of some of our systems. And his helmet comes on just like that. <laughs> That's pretty funny. And as you can see, people are getting kidnapped by Cerberus. That's no good. But can't do anything about it from right here, so let's try to head on around. Hmm, seems kind of fishy, I don't like it. Oh, hello. Let's, uh... Surprise, bitch! <laughs> uh, yeah, that's right. There may be more nearby. Play dead until it's safe, then get to Kaylee Sanders at security. Okay, but my sister Sean is out here somewhere, too. Seems like a weird way to spell Sean. Why did... What kind of a parents do you have naming your little girl Sean? <laughs> oh, that, I would be upset if I were her. Uh, I don't care. I do not like reading that. But I did get 20 EXP for it, so... Worth it. And... Okay, nothing waiting to ambush me. I always get uh, kind of paranoid when I'm in these areas. Eh? Okay, looks like we have some more people. Waiting to get stuff. Whoa, what the fuck? Ah! I was not ready for that whatsoever. Uh, let's try to. What? I hate it when that happens. Absolutely hate it. Uh, can we. No, do not, please. Okay, let's see here. I have a grenade on top of me, that is no good. Okay, one thing at a time. Oh, that was rather close. That actually did not work, and try to get a first aid going before I die. <laughs> I was just kind of counting on that stasis to freeze him so I wouldn't have to do that, but... And is that it? Okay, that was a bit fishy. Okay, that is not it, actually. Okay, only one more, it appears. And those generators, you can, like, blow them up, and they'll, like, stop whatever 
shenanigans they're like regenerating their shields with or something like that. But a lot of times I don't deal with it unless it's like a uh, large problem. And the objective is right down here. And that actually hurts me. Okay. Lesson learned. So, uh, let's see what's behind door number two. Appears we have quite. Oh. She looks familiar. Jack. Shepherd. She actually has clothes on this game. What do you know? This guy is cruising for a bruising. Everyone get down. This thing's out of your league. Shepard, keep it off. And just like the last time, we have another Cerberus fight. Oh me, oh my. So it would be beneficial if that thing did not like rape everyone. And I hate that smoke screen. Cannot see a damn thing. I'm going to try to skedaddle on over here where I actually have a line of sight. And hopefully he doesn't light me up too fast. If he's distracted with other people, it's a lot easier on myself. Especially whenever I can just completely unload on him. Okay, seems uh rather easy considering he doesn't even like know I'm here and there goes Liara so it might have just got a little bit more difficult Let's see if I can't uh, abuse the old LOS techniques and that is bad he's about to light me up Let's see if I can't uh, retreat to a safe distance Okay, I think I actually took out the Atlas, but I do not know where everything else is at. Oh, they're actually uh, casting like throw and whatnot. Uh, see if I can't run over here and pick old bitch tits up. Hey, wee 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 wee. And that's the glory of this game. You do not necessarily need a meta gel if you are uh, if you have a down teammate. You can just run on over there and give them the old pat on the back, and they'll be fine. Okay, let's try to do this a little bit at a time. There you go, Garrus, light him up. Okay, I think we're actually getting towards the end of this. Yeah, there we go.